Welcome to Supreme Family Garden. You didn't do your clap, babe. No, I'm not gonna clap today. You didn't make my chicken liver tonight, so I'm, I'm not in the clapping mood. The night's not over. Okay, then. So that's why I'm making these videos so I can get what I want to eat tonight. Anyway, guys, I am going to show you how to make money with your papaya tree. I'm going to show you how you guys can grow one of the simplest, easiest tropical fruit trees. Quit pulling me, woman. Around, all right? Now, look at this. Now, I know some of you guys may say, Supreme, why in the world do you have it growing under your loquat tree? Guys, sometimes it gets about 20 some odd degrees up here. So I and this is a tropical fruit. Yes, it is. And these babies cannot, I mean cannot take the cold. I didn't even have to cut it back, all right? This is all from last year, okay? So with the proper soil, all right, the proper environment, you too can have you one of these beautiful papaya trees, all right? Now look, this is, I'm gonna clean it off now that you guys are watching. This is the pine needle that I used to cover it from last year, all right, to protect it. See then, nice and healthy. The good thing I came out here, let it, let it breathe. So you got some fire ants around there. They were making a nest as well. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Baby, that's why you get bit every night. No, honey. Because you stick your finger in well, anyway. Well, they don't bother with me now. Yeah. Now, on this side, uh, over here, if you, over here, this is where we cut it. Well, it broke off last year, but it started to shoot up again. Now, once you guys cut it, it starts to come up like an octopus. And again, you'll have little shoots like this that actually provide fruit. Now, I know some people say that they do not grow well in uh, shadier areas. But again, in the tropics, you can go in an area where you really can't even see the sun. And these things are flourishing like no tomorrow. So again, this is proof, proof that they can thrive with the overhead canopy, right? I don't want them, especially in this area, to get too big. I only planted this and this avocado tree here to protect them from the cold, right? So now, I'm gonna show you guys. Are you back up? <laughs> Pulling on it, scared you me of, to almost to death. Now we're gonna show you guys how to grow one from the store, because this is actually one that we grew uh, from a store-bought uh, but this one up. came off our, our tree. Like this one here came, but it's yeah. the same concept. But That's yeah. Right. All right. Now, normally, they have more seeds in it than this. Now, who was trying to get you, champ? Now, this is all you guys going to do. Rake this down in there like that. For video purposes, and I'm not going to rinse them off. But the, you guys can. I have good dirt, so it don't matter at my house. Because... God give us a little bit of favor, so he let me have a few shortcuts. Folks, I want to eat this so bad. I was going to say, you're not going to eat it? Yeah, I'm going to eat it, baby. Oh. Horace, you want some of this? Yeah. I'm going to just take it. It looks bit. good. Oh, baby. But I, I don't know why. I just, that's just not the fruit. Is it sweet? Mm hmm. Really? Mm hmm. It looks sweet. Now, when you're done with it, just toss it around another plant, or you can put it in the container that you're going to be growing your seeds in. Waste not, want not. Remember, keep God happy. Because I throw this somewhere else, God might not give me the harvest that I want because he's going to think I'm wasteful. So, again, we're going to pretend now, guys, that uh, I wash these off because that's all you guys are going to do. Wash them off. Take about five or six seeds. Again, probably one inch. Drop your seeds down in there. Say two in the middle. Two on the outside of the container. Mm -hmm. Hold on, baby. Don't, I don't want to grow my hand. I'm not. But you ain't let me finish doing what I was doing. There you go. Always trying to control something. Yep. And then you want to add, say, a half inch of mulch over the top like I've already done here. All right. 
they dig at it just <laughs> all right because now with these as opposed to the low quads these re uh, require a higher moisture level okay not sopping wet but you must keep them moist they like water they like water mm -hmm. okay and when you feed them these guys can be fed as much i mean once a month they're gonna grow okay keep them moist right uh say two weeks uh, just a handful hypothetically speaking bring the camera please a tree this size right i would feed this now, again it's gonna eat as, as these leaves break down that's a little bit of carbon but there's so much more compost that's in that area from the low quads and other different things that i've actually placed in that area for this tree to grow okay uh say every say once a month a handful of 666 the following month table scraps i guarantee you guys in one year your tree will be like looking like this and we're just transitioning into the uh the winter months into the spring summer. yeah into the summer and look at how nice this tree looks so it's it's real simple probably about three weeks a month these little babies are gonna grow you'll have you something Aww. like that not not as crooked as mine but yeah and just keep it keep it water guys it's as simple as that so when you go into your local market find your healthy healthy papaya squeeze it bring it home uh take a strainer spray out the little excess take your seeds three to four seeds per container keep them in say a shady area or in your home in a window where it's going to get some light and as soon as they start to grow you can bring them outside and next few weeks few months you too can have as many papayas as you and your family would love to consume anyway guys thanks my daughter for holding the camera thank my wife for helping me in the yard today may god bless each and every one of you if you like the video we greatly appreciate it if you give us a thumbs up if you don't may god bless you anywho because we're all share the videos share the video with all your kin folks tell them we made a couple videos today and we love all y'all be safe now Grow something, make God happy. Make and your eagle. family happy too. That's right. And your wife happy. Yeah, but baby, we're talking about the other people now. I'm talking we, about me too. Yeah, because we want to make God happy. That way he come back and heal the land. See? And then y'all can grow everything in abundance. Thank you for watching.